home sweet home. Oh, hello, neighbors. And Lucy, how was your day? This is Gin and Tonic. Thank you so much for joining. Today I'm going to be making a Mai Tai for you. I haven't really done any tiki drinks yet, so I figured why not start with the Mai Tai, which is the mother of all tiki cocktails. This was invented in 1944 by Victor J. Bougeron, better known as Trader Vic. He invented this at his bar, Trader Vic's, in California, and is said to have gotten the name from a couple that came in and tried it that was from Tahini, and they said it was Mai Tai which meant out of this world or the best. Trader Vic was apparently quite the character and he got his name because he was constantly trading booze and food for goods and services. He also had a wooden peg leg that he got when he was a kid. And there were a lot of fantastic stories about how he came to have this. But the truth is he got tuberculosis in the knee when he was a kid and they had to amputate. This also kept him from being in World War II, but it didn't keep him from sending booze over to the troops in the South Pacific. To make a Mai Tai at home, you just need a couple ingredients, most importantly rum, preferably Jamaican, but whatever you've got is fine. And then some type of orange liqueur, I've got orange curacao, you need fresh limes and orgeat syrup. And if you'd like to make this yourself, I've included a link for that video as well. All right, so step one is to squeeze my fresh lime juice. And for this recipe, I'm just doing equal parts of lime juice and orange curacao. I'm gonna do three quarters of an ounce of each. And then I'm gonna do two ounces of my rum. All right. And I'm using a modern mixologist line. I can include a discount link for you below. Uh, what I love so much about this line is that they put the ounces on the side of the glass for you. So it's really helpful when you're adding fresh squeezed juice like this into the glass. So I'm gonna do equal parts of the fresh squeezed lime and my orange curacao. All right, and then I'm gonna do two ounces of my Jamaican rum, I'm using Myers because it's what I've got. One spoonful of my homemade orja. And then put some ice in your shaker and shake it till it's cold. Serve it in a rocks glass. Traditional garnish is fresh mint. You can also get real fancy and get an orchid if you want to. This is after all a tiki cocktail, so you wanna have a little bit of fun with it. I'm using one of my little bar buddies. And I've got some fresh mint sprigs as well. There you have it. I hope you enjoyed it. 
If you do make this, let me know what you think and let me know what kind of rum that you like to put in it. Um, if you've got any questions, please leave those below. And if you like the videos, hit that like button and please subscribe. I come out with new videos weekly. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Jenna and this is Jenna Tonic.